This is Princey Seats Channel, your preferred channel for most current and detailed content and information needed. You are welcome. If you are new kindly subscribe and press the notification button for further updates. UAAG Dispersing Millions to Account Pay attention to this. <laughs> Good day everyone that is listening to my voice. <clears throat> Today is Monday the 26th day of February 2024. My name is Elder Chukwemeka Emerald. Uh, there is something that is, uh, I have thought and thought and thought over it. And God has been telling me many things concerning this world. This world is something that everyone that lives in this world is supposed to be very, very careful and extra careful. Otherwise, what you are not assuming in your life, what you have not thought that it will come your way, you may see it around you. I have been pitying this man of God, Apostle Dr. Ken Wakama. I don't know. All I know why I'm saying this, I am a Christian. I believe God through Jesus Christ. But what I'm seeing and what I'm hearing makes me to shed tears. You see, this man of God, there's something I will not fail to, um, to remember. He always tell Nigeria that if somebody, somebody called him and told him that he saw he or she saw his name on the documents of UAS grant. And that's why he jumped inside the same and began to act the way they told him to act. What I'm saying is just the truth. It is how, what they told him that is acted on that. And now, see where this man, where this thing is landing this man. In fact, everybody should supposed to think about this world. Know that this world is not a living place. I can believe, I can see, and I can still understood many people that call this man meaning the man born with a golden spoon. Today, they have torn. I guess they are calling this man a scammer. The highest scammer in Nigeria. Well, why I'm saying this thing is any step we take in this life, whatever we pass yesterday, like yesterday, is full of history. We have learned a lot yesterday. And I know as we are going through this today, we are still learning. I know that if anybody call Apostle 
Dr. Ken Wakama again to come in this grant issue as a grant handler or as a country director. He will not, even that man, he will see that man as the he was his worst enemy. I have saw a lot of bullets, a lot of bullets, AK-47. In fact, many things, even those people who are supposed to call him name, supposed not to call him name, when they see him, they will call him daddy. They are calling him name now. Chai, this word, this word. As I have said, we have to learn a lot though, for what is going on now. We have to learn a lot. Today, if somebody told me that Apostle Ken Wakama will be called a scammer, I will not believe that person. But that's what I'm hearing even today. But I, Elder, I will not do that. Because I believe that this man is a victim of circumstances. He is not intended to be a country director of UAH. But he said that somebody linked him, told him that his name is on the documents. And one of the write-up I saw early this morning said that even that money arrived in Nigeria, but because of uh, 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 Jehoshaphat, Teobat, and so on and so forth, they withdraw that money back. I will give uh, Apostle Dr. Ken Wakama an advice, and if you see this voice note, please try to send it in his. Uh, uh, this thing, please, very, very important. Now, today, everybody is calling this man a scammer. Well, I will tell him to learn from this situation. Let him learn from what is going on now. And I will not waste much time in this area. I would like to tell even all grand pressure group of Nigeria, like uh, Abdul Jamal Manshin and Osta Dawood and every other member, that everybody is calling Apostle Dr. Ken Wakama a scammer because the money of UAAG he promised Nigeria, we didn't see it. This one, we say that it is you are the one who sorted it you sort who sorted it out please remember we are still on the same waiting we are still on the same waiting few weeks ago or a week ago what we saw in the uh, in the platform is that uh, the money has dropped under 12 hours it was debunked the, the and that means we are the same on we are still on the same line Oscar Dawood, i can tell you that 90 percent of nigeria now i see you as a truthful human being and we believe what you are telling us now that this morning we will get it because it is you you Austin Dawood that is telling us. If it is another person, nobody will listen to that person. So what I'm trying to say now, if you know that this morning, because according to the analysis you have given to Grand Community in Nigeria, it means that that money is real. Please, let the people who call you, who may make you to sign, on that document please appeal to them to release the money so that you will share it everybody will go 
And if we are waiting for UAS, we will know how we are going to wait for them. Otherwise, this name they are calling Apostle today, they may call it to you tomorrow. Oster Dawood, I think you are hearing my voice. The name they are calling Apostle Cain today, even when you come out and told us that uh, this country director of a team, that people has duped many Nigerians. Yes, we know that you didn't tell anybody to bring anyone Naira in this grant. We know that. There's no two ways about it. And you know that the people supported you to, to still be in Abuja. And because of you still be in Abuja, that make you to see this particular grant, which we are saying how we are going to disburse it. So we are still on the pipeline. I'm not saying that uh, I'm going to throw a bomb for you uh, with my AK-47. No, 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 that's not true. I don't have anything. Me, I don't have anything. I only say something as an elder. You know, you see this name that I call him Apostle Dr. Ken Wakama today. Eh? Make sure that something happens within this week. Otherwise, they are going to call it to you, Oster Dawood and even Jama Mesh. They are going to call you the name. That's what I'm saying. So, uh, men and brethren, all have all of us have seen what happens. CEO and NGO, you have to understand that this this money, we are getting it, we are getting it by the grace of God. What is uh, um, happening to bundle heads and so on and so forth? That's not where I go because I have said it in my previous voice note, that immediately I heard from OCG that it is one one bundle. Then, according to his video, I know that everything concerning a uh, bundle head is no, there is nothing. Even if they give 100 million or 200 million per, per bundle head, in one bundle, and that particular person has about 100 bundle heads, my friend, <laughs> it can work. So I have said it in my previous voice note. So what I'm saying now is uh, we, the Nigeria, we have summarized. We, the bundle heads, we, the elders, because we don't want, we don't need trouble. We don't need trouble. Hence, they have come out and said that they are going to dissolve this boss money. Exactly, I mean, especially uh, Austin Dawood, which Nigerians know you now as a truthful human being. Go ahead and do the needs for so that the people may not call you the same name. The bundle heads, the NGOs, why they are not saying anything is until they see the money in their, on their account. They know that whatever you are telling them is truth. Otherwise, even when you come out in that chat room and say a lot of them, how everything goes, we applaud you and we thank God for you. We appreciate what you did. But so far as it's still an area of promising, still promising, <laughs> the name they call Apostle Dr. Ken Wakama yesterday, they may call it to you people. So you have to do whatever you're supposed to do now. Let me go back to Apostle Dr. Ken Wakama. Sir, I want to give you this advice. That man or that woman who told you that your name is on the documents, can you please get her or him you go back to the uas try to plead them that they should leave they release this uh, fund back to you again it is very very important 
because the money that is involved in this i know that most of ngos they are now billionaires now somebody came out this morning and begin to beg even you and uh, chief akogun to beg jennifer isaac that they folded a number of bundles to him i mean to her at the initial stage so it is it, it is a uh, one one thousand naira to two thousand five and at the end it become hundred thousand to fifty thousand naira so, so maybe all these bundles i don't know but all, all these bundles some of them have become a rich women and women in this uag thinking that what the way you uh, you told them concerning you ages that's how it's going to be because i know that if somebody submitted about five bundles or six bundles or ten bundles and he gets a, a one bundle as a bundle head he get money for a bundle head he will not cry so much he will not cry so much now whatever they have planned thinking that even if you get bring a, a 10 10000 bundles they will receive it to you with a, the, at the rate of 50 50000 or 100 100000 so that when the uh, the disbursement will be if you get at least one bundle as a bundle head or two uh, you will you will not cry much you will forget about the other house but today you see it now some of them are going to die because i know that when the time comes i don't know what may be happen so what i'm trying to say sir this is the time for you to plead for that uas plead for them plead for them now this particular one that we are going to uh, uh, receive by the special grace of god it is they give it to you but they told that they are not going to hand it over to you because of so many uh, uh what do we call it uh, uh, a kind of uh, protest and so on people have wrote a lot of uh, this thing against you that's why APG, agpgn become the sec signatory and it is just like they are the one who are the owner of this grant so what i'm trying to say make sure you go back tell this uh, uas if you know how you are going to reconcile with all those people even Tiobat, um, um to, uh, who again to but um um that uh, Jehoshaphat and so on. And so. Go and reconcile with them. Call a meeting. All of you reconcile so that this money they will bring it and you divide it how it will be shared. By the special grace of God, everything will be calm. calm. Nigeria will be calm. So, sir, that's how I'm doing, summarizing this area. And Nigeria. The bundle heads the beneficiary. Let us continue our prayers. On this. There, uh, it have never end. Let us continue our prayer so that God will have mercy upon us. Thank you very much. God bless you. My name remains Elder Chukwemeka Emerald.